Okay, good evening everybody. Now, it's time for, now we're getting back on track and re-showing my Disney VHS collection. Now on to part three, when we last left off, I showed you the 1997 VHS of Masterpiece Collection VHS of the Hunchback of Notre Dame. Now moving on to this next tape, which is the Black Diamond Classics. This is the, this is the 1991 Black, oh, sorry about that. This is the 1991 Black Diamond Classics VHS of the Jungle Book. As we know, this is the Flickr 98's all-time favorite Disney anime movie. Got this at the Salvation Army Thrift Store in North Kings Island back in act back in September 2013. Fine. And the back it says for Pure and G, High Spirit and High Jigs of Cascade, enjoy the Jungle Book is took the top of the state by People magazine. Yep. And for previews on here, there's a preview for the theatrical release of Beauty and Beast and the Black Diamond Classic Suite, just so the rescuers down under, which I'll show later on. Anyway, I'm gonna open this tape up. As you can see, here's the tape with the ink label. Oh. And the print date is March 26, 1991. Still, this VHS of the Jungle Book is good. And we're not done with the 91 VHS yet, because I also have another copy of this. Save case at all. I've had this for an extremely long time, since so around then. You guys saw this in my other videos on my Jackie Cheese 2001 channel. Anyway, I'm going to open this tape up. Up, as you can see, except this tape has a vertical sticker label. Oh. And the print date on this tape is May 29th, 1991. Printed uh, 10 days after Mars 99, second birthday. 18 years before the Pixar movie Up was released in theaters, and 7 years before the Flickr 98 was born. And we know the. Jungle Book is the Flickr 98's all-time favorite Disney film, so yeah, there you go on that. So yeah, there you go on that. Okay, now on to the 19... We also have the 97 for you store 30th anniversary limitation masterpiece collection of each of the Jungle Book, and yep, there's the THX logo, doesn't creep me out. So you know, anyway, as you can see, he's fine. In the back it says, Rebel Music, Imagine Adventure, a Treat, Adventures, A Treat for All You Say by Dixie Winksley at WCVB TV ABC Boston. It says, Special Song Book, song, song book uh, which we know that, as I said, this copy used to have the booklet, but then I lost it. We know this used to belong to my Auntie Honey before she passed away, because then when she passed away, some of the families got to keep her stuff in. We got to keep her VHSs, and this was one of the VHSs we got to keep. Anyway, I'm going to open this tape up. Anyway, here's the tape with the ink label. And the print date is September 10th, 1997. Oh, and for previous... Oh, by the way, the 91 VHS of the Jungle Book, the one that has the sticker label, that st still has the same previous as the ink label version with Beauty, with the previews for Beauty and the Beast and the Rescuers Down Under. But for previews on this tape, there's a preview for the theatrical re-release of The Little Mermaid. And I think there's a preview for the theatrical release of Flubber, if I'm not mistaken. I think there probably is. He is, and there's also a preview for the Masterpiece Collection of just as a Peter Pan and Hercules. These and the VHS release of Beauty and Beast the Enchanted Christmas, which I showed back in part one. Anyway, I'm going to open this tape up. Oh, wait, I already showed you the tape. Sorry. But still, this VHS just a joke book is good. As we know, this film is going to get me. As we know, this film is being re released in the Diamond Edition line. It's going to come out on a Blu ray. D TV compact in the sp in the spring of 2014, but regardless of that, I am not going to get because I'm fine with the platinum edition DVD, which I will show when I do wait to see DVDs. So yeah, there you go on that. Okay, now on to the 1998, oh, the 1987 Black Diamond Classic we just of Lady and the Tramp. It says the original like, classic. I've had this for an extremely long time since then. Anyway, here's spine. In the back it says, A timeless film will stay by the Los Angeles Times, and Lady and Trip Raids will have Disney's most enduring classics to stay by the Chicago Tribune. And definitely so. And this tape does not have any previews on it. Anyway, here's the tape with the sticker label. And unfortunately, again, there's no print date. But still, this will be just so. Lady and Trip is good. Okay, we also have... The 1998 Masterpiece Collection VHS, and yep, it says fully stored, and yep, THX certified. Now, the cup got this in a box full of old tapes. 
Now, the cover art on this was also used for a 1999 limited issue DVD, which I don't have as yet, but I'm not going to bother getting it because I'm fine with the two DVDs I have, that being the Platinum and Diamond Edition, which I'm going to show when I do my Disney DVDs. Anyway, I don't know what previews are on this tape because I still have not put this in yet. I will put it in soon, though. It's fine. My goal is to put some of the tapes I haven't put in yet by the end of the... By the end of December, in the back, same Kirk review from the Chicago Tribune. It also says, says "Lady and the Tramp" has earned praise as a mar as a marvel of animation. Stay by the Chicago Daily News. Anyway, I'm gonna open this tape up. As you can see, here's the tape. This tape has an ink label, and the print date is August twenty second, nineteen ninety eight. Still, also the chests of uh, Lady Trip is good. Okay, now on to the sequel. This is the 2001 VHS of Lady and Tramp 2 Scamps Adventure. Got this the same day as I got the 98 VHS of the original Lady and Tramp. Now, I've never seen this film, but I've, I've never seen this sequel, but I hope to give the sequel a watch. Because I've never seen it. Anyway, here's Spy. In the back it says, A very worthy successor to the Disney classic of Stay By. I, Bill Hoffman of the New York Post. And I don't know what previews are on this tape because I haven't put it in yet. Here's the tape. Dark sticker label. Print date January 20, 20th, 2001. Print date six months and... Six months and ten days before I was born. Still, this be just a lady tramp to escape some adventure is good. Okay, now on to the 2002 VHS of Lilo and Stitch and Yup Teachix. It says, Funny, Sassy, and Original, stayed by Roger Ebert, Chicago Sun Times. As we know, and yes, we know this is an extremely funny movie. I think this is the, I think this is one of Disney's, I think this is one of Disney's funniest movies yet. I've had this since 2002. It's fine. Back it says, as that was my point, you can't help falling in love with Lilo and Stitch State by Claudia P. P. A. P. of USA Today. And we know the. There was also a DVD counterpart of this, which I do have the DVD as well as the 2009 two disc DVD, which I will show when I do my Disney DVDs. I'm not going to say that stuff anymore. Alright. You can see, here's the tape with the blue lid and the ink label. And the print date is December 17th, 2002. Printed about 15 days after my best friend Luke's first birthday. And for previews on here, there's a preview for the soundtrack release of this film and a preview for the theatrical release of The Jungle Book 2 and there's the sequel to The Jungle Book. But still, this VHS of We Launched It is good. Okay, now on to the 1995 Masterpiece Collection of just of the Lion King. I've had this since 95. Anyway, here's Spine. The back it says, The Greatest Winner of All, Stay by the Los Angeles Times. For previews on here, there's a preview for the theatrical release of Pocahontas. Also, the Masterpiece Collection of just of Cinderella, which I showed you in the previous part. And also, the just release of Angels in the Outfield, which I don't have as yet, but I hope to find it soon. Anyway, I'm going to open this tape up. As you can see, here's the tape with the ink label. Print date January 9th, 1995. Printed nine days after 1995 began. But still, this be just of. Uh, Lion King is good. Okay, now on to the sequel. This is the 1998 VHS of The Lion King 2 Simba's Pride. I which I got from, from, Mandy, from my sister friend Mandy back in November of 2011, as you all know. Anyway, here's Spine. In the back it says, A very wor a worthy successor to the throne of the most successful animated film of all time, saved by Scott Hendrick of the Los Angeles Times Syndicate. For previews, there's a preview for the Masterpiece Collection of Joseph Lady and a Tramp. Alright, anyway, I'm going to open this tape up. Anyway, here's the tape with the ink label. Never mind that sticker. And like I said in the video before, this tape has no print date, surprisingly. Some copies had print dates, others didn't. Like Imagination 1980's copy doesn't have a print date, but Mars 5 copy does have a print date. But still, this VHS of Lion King 2 Super Surprise is good. 
So I asked egg on that. Okay, now on to the second shelf. Shelf, which next up we have the 1990 Black Diamond Classics VHS of The Little Mermaid. I've had this since 1990. This one has the controversial cover, Triton's Palace looking like that, but no need to talk about that. Whoa. Here's mine. In the back, it says, You can wish upon a star and not character up a more joyous anime movie, a state by Time Magazine. And this tape does not have any previews on it. Anyway. As you can see, here's the tape with a vertical ink label. And the print date is May 25th, 1990. I know it's kind of strange, it's in the corner. But still, this VHS of The Little Mermaid is good. And we also have the 1998 Fully Restored Special Edition Masterpiece Collection VHS of The Little Mermaid. And yep, DJX. Certified. Got this for my sister and Eve's friend Maddie back in October of 2012. She's fine. And the back it says they don't get any better than this. Stay by Jeff Craig of 60 Second Preview. And I have not put this tape in yet, but I do know the previews because someone did upload the opening to this on YouTube. Open which Jody Be there's these two fish at the beginning and Jody Benson's there. She even talks about the previews because she talks about previews. Oh, uh, never mind the phone ringing. Here, I'll let the phone finish. Okay, someone okay, someone answered the phone, but there's these two fish at the beginning and Jody Benz is there. She talks about the previews. She talks about previews for the theatrical releases of Moonlon and the Bugs Life, also a pro for the Disney Cruise Line and the VHS release of the Spear of Mickey, which I don't have as yet, but I hope to find it soon. Anyway, I'm gonna open this tape up. As you can see, here's the tape, and it has a dark sticker label. Okay. And the print date is February 23rd, 1998. Still, the VHS of Little Mermaid is good. Okay, I think I have time to show you one more and then I'll stop because the last tape I'm going to show is for this part is the 1990, the 2000 VHS, the Little Mermaid 2 Return to the Sneak. Got this in a box of old tapes. It's fine. It says exciting, in the back it says exciting, funny, and tuneful with gorgeous animation. Say by Nell Minwell, the movie obviously by Chime Magazine. The previews, I know before the movie begins, there's a preview for the theatrical release of The Emperor's New Groove. After the movie's over, there's a promo for the Little Mermaid video game and the VHS releases of both The Hunchback of Notre Dame 2 and Lady in the Tramp 2. Here's the tape with the ink label. And the print date is July 24, 2000. Printed six days and one day before, one year before I was born. And I'll actually print it one day after my VHS of Fantasia 2000 was released. I mean, it was printed. But still, this VHS of Little Mermaid 2 Return to the Sea is good. Alright, that's going to wrap it up for part 3 because my battery again is running low, so stay tuned for part 4 which will be coming up next.